We have more on some breaking news we've been following all afternoon long. Traffic is slow moving on I-24 heading to Montgomery County after a fiery crash killed one person. News Channel 5's John Quill Newland got caught in that traffic but was able to get closer to the scene. Right now we're on I-24 and as you can see behind me, one of the 18 wheelers completely went up in flames. It was also containing hazardous materials and it caused a backup on I-24 for hours this afternoon. Officials with the Tennessee Highway Patrol tell us the wreck involved three vehicles around mile marker 22, two commercial vehicles or semi-trucks and one passenger vehicle. The person who died was in one of those semi-trucks. The other two drivers were transported to a local hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. One semi carrying hazardous materials caught fire. Fire crews have spent the majority of the afternoon cleaning that up. I've seen a couple of fire trucks and an ambulance go by, so I'm assuming there's a wreck up there with some, with some fire damage. Now the wreck caused a backup for miles in the westbound lanes of I-24. Folks, y'all gonna need to get turned around, okay? Make you some room, get turned around, come down this right shoulder. Traffic was rerouted to exit 49, which had seen a lot of congestion this afternoon. Near the Robertson-Montgomery County lines, I'm John Quill Newland, News Channel 5. Thanks, John Quill. The exact cause of the crash is under investigation, but we're getting word the first semi was stopped on <coughs> the interstate when the second semi crashed into it, causing the first commercial truck to hit the passenger car in front of it.